Hi, how are you guys? I'm back. Now I would like to make a Bagdunsiya in Arabic language and it comes from parsley like you see and in American uh, uh, word it's called uh, um, parsley with tahina sauce. So how are we gonna make that? I'm gonna show you guys how we're gonna prepare that together. what I'm gonna show now okay uh, the parsley here I just buy it clean it and I suck it with water too many times make sure it's clean no dirt in it so I'm gonna put it on the on the shershaf or sheets okay and let it dry until tomorrow this is should be look like and I keep it until tomorrow overnight and after that I show you guys what we're gonna do Bagdunsiya, which is parsley with tahini sauce. Okay, so we talk about it tomorrow. Here you go. So where we gonna use tahini sauce, the main important, okay, and the salt and the garlic. Garlic, you know, whatever, how much you like. Some people they like it extra. Some people they like it natural taste and lemon juice lemon juice i you know i squeeze like four or five of them because that that part it needs lots of uh, squeezing juice and i got jalapeno sauce by choice people they like it hot and people they didn't like it hot so i would like to chop the parsley right now i want to show you guys that. let's begin i chop this here and i put it underneath it to chop all stick together. You see what I'm saying? Here you go. It's very easy for you guys if you do it that way. Hold it in my hand, flip it, other side. And what do we do? You see what I'm doing? It's very easy job this way. But this is good size for tabula. Here you go. You don't need it so a very, very tiny, uh, small. So now I'm gonna chop it small because the Bagdunsiya, it should be uh, very, very small pieces from the parsley. <laughs> okay, <laughs> all right guys. This is, should be the chop, final chop, okay? The parsley should be the final chop, all right? And the fluffy because it's dry from the water. It should be that way okay because we're gonna squeeze it with the lemon and the taste flavor and also let me finish the rest here okay and I'll be back okay guys I'm back I, I did everything here I have for five bunches you know of the parsley that's how it, it becomes okay and this is the final uh, touch it should be and after that we have to prepare it together to add the other ingredients to make it the uh, Bagdunsiya in Arabic. Okay? Alright guys. Hi guys, I'm back. Uh, what I did after, I have a chopped garlic here. Chopped garlic and uh, chopped jalapeno. jalapeno. And uh, I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna mix it to put it together. To put the dish together. So I got the tahina sauce. I put some here. I don't know for how many people you want to do, but for my family, I have six people. So it's going to be extra for me. I need to use uh, tahina sauce. For two people, for three people, it depends. But I'm going to show you the final dish, how it's going to look by catching eyes and you, you learn for, for that. All right, so I got here the um, tahina sauce. It should be soft. Smash it before you add anything. Keep it smash, smash it, you know? I like to smash it with a spoon because from the back of the spoon, make it soft. So what I do now, I add salt, like one tablespoon salt. I add water, like one cup water. Okay, 
So after I add water, I mix it together with the salt. Now I'm gonna add the flavor, which is the lemon juice. You keep stirring it, you know, because it gets thick together with the lemon and the, the water. And what do you do? You add garlic. Don't put the whole thing in one time, just a little bit, you know, and you taste it. It should be smooth. Keep mixing it until it's smooth. Okay. I added more lemon juice to it and it should be like that. It's uh, it's not thick and it's not thin. It's between. If you feel it, you feel the heavy from the bottom. Heavy thick a little bit from the bottom. So this part is ready. And the garlic is perfect. I got half of the parsley here and what I do, I add it to it. Just like that. Why I do that way? Because I don't want to be like short and tahina sauce. And I go over with the measure. Because you cannot measure this. It's, it's not easy. So by catching eyes, you notice. Okay. I want you two guys to see over here. Come on, Liana. You see this part? It should be that way, but I have still here. What I do now, I add a little bit more parsley. To add this over here. All right, I'm still mixing it together. And I think I'm gonna taste it now to see if it need lemon or water. If I have extra lemon here, I add water. If I have perfect touch, I just need to put a little bit water, okay? Let me just try it. All right, I add everything together, which is the garlic, the lemon juice, and the tahina sauce. I would say for this major, uh, so like you guys, you see, I don't use the, the whole thing for the tahina I use. I show it to you in the camera. So I would say for this tahina, you need, you need one cup or one and a half cup, I would say, tahina sauce for this major. And you need one big garlic, Chop. I would say two tablespoons salt, okay, and I use uh, like about one cup water and five whole lemon juice. I mix it together, but I see it like a little bit thick, but the taste wonderful, tasty. So what I add, just a little bit water, a little bit touch water, like one full spoon. And you see guys, it should be this is final touch. That's it. I hope you guys you can make that. It, it's it's delicious. My family love this one. People they like that for like to do grill, and if they have cas whiskey, cas arak with the maza, arabia maza, it tastes good. When you serve it, you can have it with the pira bread, an Arabic pira bread. Okay, but this one I don't add the the chub jalapeno so i'm gonna split this one in half and you can add if you want jalapeno you can put jalapeno for the people they like the hot sauce and that's it here you go enjoy it <laughs>